Consequences. I have something special for you. Half-Life 2 full stream with a couple of enhancements. On top of this is M-Mod, which adds some stuff. All of it is customizable. Vinny, you should have played the mod with Alex and her fully modeled cervix and Virginia. I heard about that. Why the fuck? That's the cinematic mod, by the way. And uh, you got to see some of the models in the cinematic mod. Not to throw shade because I haven't played it. But I've seen the models for the other characters. And shine, Mr. Awful. Freeman. Um, is it bad that I just think of Gmod when I see most of these models? I'm just immediately transported back to rag dolls and stupidity. I mean, most of my Half-Life memories are now Gmod. Fuckers, where's these shadows? I'm gonna pick up that can. Who am I? What am I? Again, if you never played it whatsoever, the Black Mesa incident, Gordon Freeman was the scientist there, and he uh, opened a rift by pushing a crate. He pushed like a, a, a thing into a thing, and then alien portals opened up. And then later, an alien race called the Combine came to the planet. And they took over the planet. What a life. At least you got an apartment. Everything's happy here. There's no children, but if there were, they'd be happy. When is it all going to end? It's not. Get rid of your TV, you don't need it. A strange man enters your building and just starts throwing TV. <laughs> That's a, that fucking scream sound. Too much of this is now just me associating Gary's mod. It's gonna be tough to take some of it seriously. Most of it I can, but... yeah. Dr. Freeman, I presume. Thank God it's not the cinematic mod. We better hurry. What, did you see that glass just spinning? Oh, fucking goddammit, Lamar. Look what I got. Cool, right? That's logical. Getting a baton, that's pretty logical. Vinny, there's inspect animations. Oh, if you press R, you get to check out your weapon. That's cool when you get to unlock the skins. Half-Life 3 will be that. It's gonna be mobile only, but... Uh, when we get it, you can inspect every weapon from every angle. And you can put, like, a pot leaf on it. Huh. Why am I laughing at this? So anyway, that's the precise amount of bullets it takes to kill one of those barnacles. It's just, uh, shaving a haircut. Yeah, this was pretty fucking mind-blowing, though. I don't know, playing this game for the first time... ...and just taking in the world and the detail. The apartment buildings, always the citadel in the background. Just so you can't forget about it. Just so you know that it's always there. Watching you. What's the quick save button? I don't remember. Um, Alt F4. We're still doing that joke. It's been 10 years, chat. It's been 15 years, 20 years even. Okay. You get transported to the world of Half Life 2, but you only can shoot in knocking a haircut. Sorry, shaving a haircut. Oh my god, <laughs> you fuckers. Oh god! That is so very satisfying. Hell yeah. The reason I'm streaming this is because I watched a video, a Half-Life Retrospective video, by Liam Triforce. It's really good. It's really well done. And I don't know who this YouTuber is, but they put a lot of work and passion into their video, and it made me want to stream this game. Fuck! 
fuckers. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> nice. But it works in small doses. Robber! My eye string! I tried. I can do a scientist from Half-Life, but I can't do a zombie. Go ahead and get in the boat, Dr. Freeman. Oh, sorry. Okay. Okay. That, that's, that's how lighting works, I guess. And there is an episode where uh, a hollow plastic barrel uh, lands on Worf in kind of a comical way with a hollow thud and uh, Worf break his spine is then severed and, and he's considering telling Riker to kill him and then he's like I must die and Riker's like no there has to be another way and then they find a surgery that can bring him back to life with no you know uh, no problem whatsoever but he's still convinced that he must die <laughs> oh, that's just in my inventory now. That's fucking awesome. Anyone know how to drop this? Still can't get this unless I shoot all of it. So how's your day going, chat? Going well? What's what's new? Flip! Ah! I did a fucking barrel roll and everything. They just took that fucking grenade. Man, that is satisfying. Where are you going? Where are you going? Very unrelated note, but I find myself- Oh my god. Oh, I remember this. This was amazing the first time I saw it. Still pretty good, too. Still pretty good. Just barrel right through that real quick. Vinny, are you going to do any of the other Half-Life games? Um, Black Mesa Source, for sure. And then, of course, we're gonna do a full playthrough of Hunt Down the Freeman. And say to Gordan, Fuck. Now that was a joke. And then Gordan crowbar him until dead. Never. And then after that, I'll do DMC2. Beast game. Beastie game is good for you and me. Whoa! Someone just said it's Cleveland River. Fun times in Cleveland today. Cleveland. Okay, G-Man sighting somewhere around here, got it. Gary Mann, that's his name, yeah. Gary Mann. M-A-N-N. -N. Gary Newman? Gary Seinfeld. Randy Newman? George Costanza. Gary Busey. Paul Simon. <laughs> what is this bit? Move on, next bit. Ding. No, it wasn't a sneeze, I was imitating the noise, don't worry. Citizen! We could certainly use the extra help around here. We've covered a lot of ground in the last few months, but things would go so much faster if we had more people with your training. Remember how I said this playthrough was gonna local teleport technology. <laughs> the combine still hasn't mastered. <laughs> teleport technology, she said. String -based. That's the old passage to Ravenholm. Into a hole. We don't go there anymore. What? We don't go there anymore? No. No. Come on. Good thing I won't have to go there then. God, years of Gmod. <laughs> this isn't even fun anymore. It's just oh yep, that's exactly what it's supposed to do. Gmod. Ow. Now let me call dog. He loves to play fetch. Yo, there's a dog in this dog. game? I love ah. dogs. They're cool. Oh fuck! My initial reaction replicated. You suck, dog. Well, 
Guess we're going through Ravenholm. For some reason, I just had a weird memory of me being in a doctor's office. Just a really bizarre memory. I don't know if maybe I was sick when this game came out. But it was just a very vivid, strange memory of an old doctor that I had that I haven't had in years. Yeah, there's a whole uh, Half-Life 2, like, tech demo. Looked awesome. But no one ever did this. I feel like, as a result of me playing this, I'd like to watch Full Life Consequences at some point. Because I haven't seen that in about seven or eight years. John Freeman, over here! We're attacking his place. You shouldn't come here! And the bird zombie has ghost, done leave this place! Down because you are a headcrab zombie! God, Half-Life 2 memes... ...from the early days... Some top quality shit. I like how many people know the lines to that. All I have to do is say full life consequences and then people just start spouting all the lines. Very quotable. Behind you. Reaction time. You do well to be vigilant. Thanks, creepy priest man. Well, did you see that fucking head crab? Just tank that hit. Holy shit, head crab. What an unfortunate way to die. So first, I'm hit, I'm sniped by a head crab, and then the fucking barrel, the barrel gets me. Barrels of fun. That's right. Cl the classic vine sauce fictional character, Barrels of Fun. Sushi. <laughs> I, I like reading that line from Blade Runner where he says, Sushi. It's what my ex wife called me, cold fish. I like reading it in different ways that are also terrible. Like even more terrible than the way he did it. That's what my ex-wife called me. Holdfish. Part time. <laughs> Fuck. Now, Thanks. Keep it close. Secret. My advice to you is aim for the head. Hush. Man, you get the shotgun four hours in, in this game. At some point, Father Grigory's just like, Alright, you can stop. He's pissed because you killed all of his friends. Last time I had Popeyes, I just got their dessert. They have this, like, weird banana parfait thing that I'm a weirdo for. It's just cheap, like, fill your fucking face with some fucking sweet sugar asshole. It's really, really... Um, good in that sense. <laughs> I was doing vocal exercises today. I had to, uh, I looked up a YouTube video, and one was... And as I'm doing this, I look over to the next car at the red light next to me, and they're looking at me, and my lips are flapping around like a fucking horse. He's fine. Just hanging out in fire. <laughs> Still laughing. They um they told me that originally this this gun, the pulse rifle was was designed as like a flare gun and the reload animation was all kinds of like fucked. Like they just didn't do anything with it. So here, here's the reload. Nice. Okay, Alex, we're all set. And I'll see you in Nova Prospect. See you back for now. Bye, Alex. Oh, you can dismount the cannon. Hell yeah.
That was Lamar's, um... Not just his cousin. I'm gonna kill all the Lamars, but the Woe Lamars and the Chill Lamars, too. That's terrible. Well, anyway, I got me a pet ant lion. It's called Butt Lion. Butt Lion! Butt Lion, where are you? Can you kill someone with a single ant? Maybe you could put it in one of their arteries? But then you need another item to scoop out a path to the artery. Yeah, you can clog them, but not ant alone. You might need an ant and a syringe or something. This is a weird conversation. Vinny, have you seen what the cinematic mod does to this area? It's pretty horrible. Let's take a look. So the cinematic mod just adds random shit. It's like, hey, this area needs a plane. But is the plane's storage compartment fully modeled? I like the car segment better and have- ah! I like the car segment better in half Five. two, but I like this vehicle a little bit more for the, yeah, because it, it shoots. Have you ever wondered why we age? <laughs> All right, I'll st I'm stopping before I'm even starting. Cells stop replicating well, but why? Oxygen, but why? Telometers, DNA degradation. Okay, this is turning into a Hideo Kojima plot, but. We could just keep going backwards, and I could just keep asking, why? We die because we're shit. God damn it. <laughs> Get your car in the garage. What? That's a garage? Vinny, that's John Freeman, who was Gordon Freeman's brother. Oh, that's true, it is John Freeman! John Freeman smiled! He moved really fast. Where's John Freeman? John Freeman, I need your help. John Freeman took my fucking car- PARK IT IN HERE! I park it in there, he just steals it, drives away, lives. Becomes the new hero of Half-Life. Okay, alright, I'm having a little bit of trouble. I know how to get through this. Freeman, we'll take the cliff path before another gunship finds us. Why do you sound like John Freeman? Did you take his face? Good rocket launcher. Good boy. The Freeman can also coax his appliance to attack specific targets. Observe the training mannequin and mark it well with another pheromone. Mannequin. Why did they spell it weird like that? Like Mannequin Skywalker? I'm not going planicking with Mannequin. Anakin panicking. <laughs> I love the ants! Did she just say engage wizard? Yeah, you like it? Pick up that can! <sighs> I'm alright. So just get a little bullet stand. Cool sound effect there. DMC2. Those dumbasses fired that in this small room. And and he lived? Vinny, you blew yourself up with a grenade. Touche? I can't believe that just happened. Yeah! Yeah, shoot it, get stinged! Yeah, do nothing! <laughs> oh my god, that 
That was the most brutal headcrab death I've ever seen. I can't lose you. Get out while you can. We're not leaving here without you. I know what you want me to say, chat. I can reprogram these turrets to attack the enemy. Set them up to defend the control room. Okay. Yep, this is a pain in the ass, isn't it? They make it real difficult for you to get those turrets. Down there. Not difficult, but just annoying. I'm not bringing five turrets with me, chat. I'm not. If you bring all of them, you can steamroll the teleporter segment. Gordon, what's taking you so long? Oh. Oh, that's smart, Gordon. Here, let me take one. Let me take a couple. I can hold one in each arm. Gordon, that's really reckless. Gordon, they might hit me by accident and I might die. Are you okay with that? This hallway is now safe. Whoa, what the fuck? Alex, I didn't know you could teleport. How many turrets are here? This is another three? <laughs> oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? Look at them work. My children. My family. Couldn't bring a son with me, but that's okay. At least it wasn't broken and glitched. Oh, G-Man! He was on TV. Whoa, whoa floating? Paranormal G-Man. Makes glass float. Who's the G-Man, huh? The oh, G-Man! Welcome... Welcome to the show. Welcome to Jay Leno. Tell me. What made you teleport around and do the things you did so fast? Can you drive? Do you get a license when you're a demon? Oh, John Freeman's here. Look at him. He's ready. Keep the benefits of unification. Sometimes I and dream we, about we shall. Now's not the time, John. Hey man, you do you need a medic? You alright? Good? Yep. Yeah, alright, we're good. Alright, no, he's fine. These are not friendly turrets. My family was reprogrammed. Fuck it, I'm saving. I'm going to fucking balls to the wall save here. Ah. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I got this. <laughs> I'm fine. This is my best quick save yet. The MC1 is cool. The MC3 is good. The MC2 is best. No. The MC2. How did you survive that? What the fuck? One for me and one for me. I don't feel anything anymore. Yeah, but I I, I feel pain. I need a med kit. Thanks. How did you live? Oh. Yeet. What the fuck? What the fuck? I got yeeted! Yeah, this is fine. Gordon wants to be in this thing. You know, Gordon just likes tram rides. And since we didn't get one at the beginning of the game... This'll do. Vinny, some people get really mad at your fully modeled joke. Well, fuck them. What's the joke? There is no joke. In the cinematic mod, they modeled Alex's labia. Th there's a joke there? Yeah, Vinny Vine saw us. I'm pretty mad at you, bro. You're making jokes about cervixes and fully modeled. I don't know, dude. It adds to the realism. 
Oh, you posted cringe, bruh. You posted cringe, bruh. That's him. So tell me, Gordon, do you even talk? I don't know, you know, whatever. There he is. This fucking thing. What was he saying about the host body? I, I missed some of that. What, what was going on there with the host body? I too can survive in a different dimension, Dr. Breen, by becoming a pancake. <laughs> what are we doing? Oh no. He started his ascent. What are we gonna do, Alex? <laughs> You need me! Gordon, we've got to get out of here. Maybe we still have- I remember I used that explosion a lot in Gary's mod. This is where I get off. Meaning he really enjoys this part. Lamar! Blast that little... Where did she get to? You have to wait a while before you can get the continuation of the story. Not forever, but still a while. They... they yoinked them away. What a drop. After you, Gordon. Gordon! <laughs> <laughs> and thus ends the story of Gordon Freeman. <laughs> oh, okay, I thought I was dead. Oh, I am dead. Alex ragdolled. Zombie. Don't say it. That's like a a, a zombine, right? <laughs> zombine, get it? So fucking cool, though. Alex, can we go in the train, please? Alex, can we go in the train? And here we are. In the middle of Stay some back. forest. Man, that's so fucking cool still. Still to this day. Ooh, Ray. Let me see if I can get working again. Look at the river. Isn't it cool? This could take a while. Vinny, what the fuck? I sneezed at the same time as you. You're infecting me with clown flu. Goodness. Also, that wasn't a sneeze. That was a... Yes. The diseased Ooh. fart noise. Okay. Oh my god. No! Ah. Ah. Uh. Let us hurry, Freeman. I have to tell you about the text Help message I just got in the mind from my friend. He just texted me a picture saying, in my neighborhood, and it, it's a picture of a deer licking its own asshole. So that's that's what I have to deal with. That that's my friends. That's what I have to deal with. And- and right during the most, like, gut-wrenching moment... ...of Half-Life 2, uh, well, one of... Beetlejuice, have you tried my Crystal Head Vodka? Nice fucking vodka! Honk honk. 
All right, that's enough of that. That's enough of that. We're, we're, we're here to be serious. All right, you're, chat, you're stuck down here in these mines, these caves. For weeks. And you just run out of food. And like a week later, you have water, but you're starving. Do you eat that? They have acid that can dissolve rocks. I don't think they're edible. Yeah, but that's only in the... The sclack gland. Every other part of them is probably fine. Just avoid the sclack lack gland. And then, you know, Tarantino might be directing a Star Trek movie. Okay, it's gonna be about feet in space, okay? Alright? It's gonna be about the crew dealing with giant intergalactic feet, okay? Right? Like, so here's what we're gonna do. Hello, uh, Quent Quentin? It's me, Danny Aykroyd. Uh, I'd like to let you know that I am available for Star Trek. I just need you to do some product placement of my Crystal Head Vodka. Hey, that's cool, Danny, but do you have, like, Crystal Foot Vodka? Okay? Like a Crystal Foot with vodka in it? Weirdest season of vine sauce yet. I d have not had any alcohol or excessive coffee today either. Galax Vance clings. <laughs> Sorry, I was just. My kin are still Awful. Ah! That was like one of those video game moments where you, you, the character turns their back on something and gets stabbed. Wait a minute. That happened already in this game. Uh, yeah, we can do this. Yes, we can do- yes, we can do this. Sure we can. No, you're fine. Dude, you're fine. Yes! You're fine. Misunderestimated. I'm just running interference at this point. Wow, they're fucking amazing. The larval extract. Yes. The extract. Yes. Agree. Reminder that they had to simplify this level because playtesters got lost looping at the same area over and over again. I can see that. If everything looks the same and it's just like tunnel maze, I... I could get it. I could understand that. Yes, the Eiffel Tower and the Statue of Liberty should be down in these caves to show that everyone can go a different way. Whatever that means. Somehow the aliens found a way to teleport them down here. I, for one, welcome the Germa takeover. Fine with it. Thank you for hitting Vinny in the head with an axe. Oh, the deep fake? <laughs> yeah. It's just basic math. Man, I like this guy. This guy gives me compliments and shit. Usually when you're escorting someone, they're just like, Hey, save me! But this dude's like, Ah! You are very good! And you should try Crystal Head Vodka. 100% natural, no additives, no terpenes, pure, delicious vodka. Straight from Montreal. Yeah, I like- this is a good sound. I like this sound. No, it without a Freeman Fuck! He tried to put pressure on the- Oh No! That's a cool trick, Mr. Skeleton. Can you teach me? Behold... The extra... Yes. Secretion. Make haste. Join now as we imbibe the extract. Yes. That freaked me the fuck Dr. out the first time I saw that. Freeman. Well, now 
Listen carefully, my dear. When you see your father, relay these words. Prepare for unforeseen consequences. <laughs> Creepy as fuck. Good luck out there. Who was that? Oh, that was a person. I was like, is that another one? So I wonder what's going on here. Why are, why are things slowing down and getting nice and crusty? How old is your PC? Maybe like two years since I upgraded fully. But the, the GPU is, is very new. Um, I definitely need more RAM. I got 16 gigs. Yo! Man, the Vortigaunt's just alright with that. It's just doing some sha la 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 la. Oh, fuck off. Ow! I don't know. Ah, <laughs> good. Chet, did you hear that? What was that? Ow. 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 Hey, I'm all out of stuff. Dayless. Fuck. Ow. Dayless. Oh, I can do whatever I want with the frog. I can bend the frog to my will. What the fuck happened to the door? <laughs> Holy shit. I cheesed it. I wanted to cheese it. But the the door became cheese. A, a far superior car to the to the buggy. Except it doesn't have a turret, so it's inferior. The Alex fans gave him a kiss. And now she has all kinds of different alien diseases that are not native to this planet. Her immune system will not be able to fight. The end. And this car just sounds cool. No seatbelt, but we got suspension. We got suspension! Okay. That's a permanent neck injury on top of having a strange alien disease that cannot be... Oh, he's already dead! Classic noise. Oh, I hate it so much. It's veiny. Ah! <laughs> Vinny, I think you were missing sound effects. Ah! Like uh. It appears to be in my way. Just fell apart. If only I had. A, if only you had a gravity gun. Boy, are we glad to see you guys. John Freeman. Looking for my brother. Have you seen John Freeman, my brother? Right back at him. Butt chugging. Yep. It's not good for you. It is very not good for you. Anyway, do you remember that, um... Man, I've, I've snorted sugar one time. High school, am I right? But, uh... Some weird flickering issues. It was like the, the sugar at the bottom of those, like, Sour Patch Kids. Like, the leftover sugar. And it was like big grains of sugar. Big grains of... Oh! I don't know what the fuck just happened. One of the lasers shot him, I guess? Well, we're stuck here, so we may as well stop here. Um, yeah, you can wait in the car. It's stuck on a tree. Alex is gonna wait in the car. This is fun, Gordon. This is the zombie ghost house, really? So we blew up the house and killed the zombie ghost. So they were at peace. Zombie ghosts live here, and they say leave this place. Vinny, where's the crystal head vodka? Oh, we made it. 
Stay we did fast. it. We're safe. I can't believe we're finally safe after all these trials and tribulations. Now, before I go, <laughs> before I continue, let's do the Crystal Head Vodka review. Not too unsmooth. My review is it's not too unsmooth, um, and I have zero comparison. Yeah, it's it's fine. I think it's probably a little bit overrated. Doctor Freeman, you made it. Hey. But it is Boy, it is like definitely for vodka. I mean, if you're drinking it straight, it's smoother than I thought it would be. They set up this big facility in the middle of the white forest. AR two, no, now an AR three, sure, plenty of times. There is no such thing as an AR three. Well, see, in the city, the place was lousy with AR threes. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. No, it was. <laughs> so, do you know what the alternative fire method does on the AR two? It kills hunters. How did you city folk kill hunters? We sure as hell didn't use guns. We would just wrestle hunters to the ground with our bare hands. Oh, God, come on. I used to kill 10, 20 a day, just using my fists. Oh, so when you're out in the field, you're going to be punching hunters? In the field? I'm not going out in the field. I'm a radio operator. Now that the suppression field is down, we all have to do our part. Dad? Can you blame an old man for wanting grandkids? Uh-oh. <laughs> Eli, stop. What happened to you? Dad, it's not what it looks like. I'm fine. Are you sure? Shouldn't we have that looked at? Really? I'm fine. Uh, <laughs> You've been stabbed through the chest. Get this huh. him right yeah, you're right! Uh, okay. Yes, we're just going to look at me now. Yes. Yes, hello. Do you have any idea how long oh. until the super portals are? <laughs> <laughs> this is where you put the gnome, by the way. You're not doing anything. Make yourself useful and find oh. out what the hell is going on in there. Goodbye, Lamar. The blast Cannon now. We're sending the gnome home. The or the side. crab. But yeah, you can really taste those diamonds in that crystal head what vodka. What a... For, a hug? Yes. The situation's not going to investigate itself. Please, hug? No. Alright. There was no stopping there. That's as much episode three as we'll ever see officially. There's something else here. The Borealis? It's real? Oh yes, quite real, despite its almost legendary stature. Now it's extra legendary. Dad. Prepare for unforeseen consequences. What did you say? There is no way we can launch before those striders are Oh, oh excuse me if what? I'm interrupting tea time. I'll just step out until you've finished, if that's more convenient. It's okay. Or my magnet. Was there a splash noise? Freeman, if you pull this off, I might just forgive you for that debacle at Black Mesa. You know the one I mean. Involving a certain micro. Can I get a clip of that? Ah! Oh. Man, fuck your casserole. I don't even care that I blew up your casserole. Why are you wet? What a wet, go moist, greasy man. Who eats shitty casseroles? Your casserole deserved to be blowed up. <laughs> you hurt yourself more than you hurt me, Mr. Freeman. The whole launch is a bust. John? And in case striders aren't bad enough, Brother! Gates are being escorted by packs of hunters. Good. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> fuck you! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Fuck! Whoa, Keep careful the there. Work, Fucking we careful. We held them off. Good work, everyone. Hello, John Freeman. Thanks, Freeman. I have done our family proud. All right, here we go. No gnomes, but... Lamar's in there, at least. That ship must never be used. You have got to destroy it. 
Whatever the cost. Where are you two? You're gonna this miss This is it. just making right me pissed there, off Alex. now. Gordon, thanks for everything you've done. For Alex, for all of us. I couldn't be prouder if you were my own son. Now, God damn it, Valve. Back, we've got a lot to talk about. Come on. Why would you do this to me, Valve? This is it. Oh. My goodness. Yes. Yes. Oh. 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 We did it. Oh, we did it, oh, Gordon. We sure as hell did. Oh, and not a moment too soon. I bet the Combine aren't too happy right now. You got that right, sweetheart. But we've got plenty to celebrate. I wish you didn't have to head off so soon. I'll just well, stay. I'll just stay. We'll just stay out here. We'll be all right. I just wish all this didn't fall on you, Alex. Your mother would be so proud. Dad. Dad. Gordon! Help! Ah. Listen to me. Destroy that ship. Uh. Whatever it takes. Destroy it. Don't! Dad, look out! No! Dad! Dad! Uh. Imagine leaving an entire series that's beloved by millions off like this, with no resolution. No wonder people are pissed. This is why people get upset. Because that's a really fucking upsetting ending. Gordon's voice actor left Valve. That's the real story. They just couldn't carry on without him, I guess. Sorry that that was the end of the Half-Life 2 streams. Because, um, that sucks. That, that's how we have to end off, but that's how we have to end off. First, I want to show you something, just to bring the mood back up a little bit. I want to show you something iconic. Appropriate, let's say. Appropriate for my play session. Not that. What was that? Well, we can actually hear. I think we can hear the real voice. 